This is Raghu Kulkarni, uh, Director of Software at Viking Technologies. Today I'm here to talk about um, InvDem offering uh, that Viking uh, uh, produces. Um, InvDem, as uh, we all know, it's got a DRAM and a flash uh, backed up by uh, a supercapacitor. <clears throat> uh, here we're going to demonstrate uh, InvDem in a different platform, which is from a Microsoft, uh, from a super. From uh, Supermicro, um, it's called uh, X9 DBS. Uh, essentially, it is a dual controller, uh, mainly used uh, for storage appliances. Um, we're going to demonstrate uh, um, an NV DIM, essentially in this slot over here. Um, currently, we have a DDR3-based NV DIM, which is uh, 8 gig in capacity. Um, we can have NV DIMs uh, in either slots and it can go across the uh, processors. Um, although there is uh, one restriction where you need to have like a standard DIMM uh, in the very first slot on the CPU zero. Apart from that, if you were to have uh, more memory slots, you can expand um, NV DIMMs in there. Um, we also have a, a PCI-based uh, supercapacitor. This is the energy backup. Um, and uh, you can actually plug in more than one NV DIMMs into this energy pack. Essentially, what, what's going to happen is all the data that uh, will be um, uh, in a phase two will be stored in the DRAM portion of the NVDIM. And when there is a power failure, as you know, the data will be moved to uh, the flash on the NVDIM. And upon uh, restoring the power, the data will be copied over from the flash to the DRAM and readily be accessible to any of the applications. Um, so in this scenario, um, you can uh, have 8 gig of space either as block device or it can be accessed as a byte addressable device uh, memory mapped into the OS. Um, essentially, there are two ways you can use this. Uh, you can also have uh, um, you know, inbuilt uh, allocations like from the programming that you can use non-volatile memory instead of system memory for all your applications. Today um, we have DDR3 based product uh, but in the short future we're coming out with uh, DDR4 which can go up to 8 gig, 16 gig and 32 gig. Um, that's uh, pretty much it uh, what I'm presenting today. Thank you.